So let's say I now want to expand 1 minus 3x to the minus 3. So the n is going to be replaced with minus 3. The x is going to be replaced with minus 3x. So we have 1 plus minus 3 times minus 3x plus minus 3 times minus 4 over 1 times 2. And we're going to have minus 3x squared. Make sure it's going in a bracket. We've got to make sure that we're squaring both the 3 and the minus sign that's there. Now we've got minus 3 times minus 4 times minus 5 over 3 times 2 times 1. I'll be consistent. 1 times 2 times 3 times by minus 3x cubed plus other terms. Okay, so we've got 1 uh, plus 9x. Okay, I'm now going to resort to a calculator. Okay, so we've got... 3 times 4 divided by 2 uh, times by 9, okay, so 54. So we've got 54x squared. Keep an eye on the minus signs here. The minus sign got cancelled out there. We've got the minus sign getting cancelled out there. Then we have minus 3 times minus 4 times minus 5. So 3 times 4 times 5 is 60. Divided by 6 is 10. Over here we've got minus 3 cubed which is uh, minus 27. So we've got minus 10 times minus 27 is plus 270x cubed. Okay. One thing to really notice with these is that there will be uh, a pattern with the pluses and minuses. So if you go through a load of pluses and you find that one at the end is a minus, it may be that the minus is wrong. Okay. So it's a good check to make sure that you're doing this correctly.